Ask Credit by Little Undart. Which genre of music do you loathe? Overplayed radio music. Even a good song can be a hammer to your sanity when it's overplayed on the radio. Edit, wow. I didn't think my comment even qualified as an actual genre, but I guess people hate it as much, if not more, than I do. I just woke up to 6k upvotes and I'm like, um, what so thanks for that surprise. Lol, thanks for the awards too, I know they aren't free anymore. I literally can't handle Adele anymore. She's got a nice voice and seems like a nice person but if I have to listen to Rolling in the Deep or Hello from the other side I beat my head repeatedly 104.3 my from please. Edit, I'm poor my car is old and economical. I don't have easy access to Spotify unless on my old laptop. I use radio when driving. Primary school recorder ensembles. Thank you for requesting hot cross buns. Now here's three blind mice. Novelty Christmas songs where they replace the lyrics with animal noises. Meow 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 bark 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 meow meow bark bark woof. This is so specific. How did this become prominent enough in your life to hate? Schlager I got no equivalent in English for it but imagine if someone who did low effort, shallow, cheesy feel good jingles for advertisement decided to do at least 3 minutes of it to entertain a beer hall full of retirees. I have never heard of this type of music but your description of it has me in tears. Don't know the exact name of this genre but the we're popping bottles all night pop. Best example is the recent remake cover of I'm Blue. Do you mean the one that's like I'm feeling alright? I'm about to have the best freaking night of my life BC I have to hear it 4 times a day in retail and it's the corniest lack of substance song I've heard in a while. I don't hate any genre, but my least favorite is probably Christian pop because that has the least substance to me. The pastor at the church I grew up in referred to it as Jesus is my boyfriend music. That subgenre of country music where everyone has to be poor, simple and stupid in order to be a good person. Which is often really funny to me when they sing about that in a music video featuring multi-million dollars worth of tractors, combine harvesters, Monsanto licensed crops, and other things that no regular wage salary earning person that the music is meant to appeal to could ever afford for themselves. A lot of these TikTok songs are just so formulaic. Almost to the point where I can practically guarantee they have a family member who works for a label. Industry plants are rampant on TikTok. Songs specifically made for TikTok. Did you know that Sirius XM has a station dedicated to TikTok songs? Post 9 stroke 11 country. Morgan Wallen can't melt steel beams. Country rap. Hick hop. Hick hop. Lol. Croatian trap music. This is so specific lol. What's different about Croatian trap from other trap music? Christmas. Years in retail will do that to you. I worked in retail 4 years and I still remember the day I woke up with if I could turn back time stuck in my head. I got to work and it was playing. I left work and it was playing again. Not a genre, but those girls with guitars singing in cursive. It's a genre, the name is Ayo turn that shit off. Whatever genre the Burger King commercials fall into. It's actually crazy that Reddit can agree on something. That something is that modern country music is dog shit. And then someone brings up Bo Burnham and you get a whole thread repeating the damn lyrics. Modern country is just pop with steel guitar and stupid lyrics with a twang. Complete crap. A while back, Tom Petty said that modern country music is just bad rock with a fiddle. I think you both nailed it. That, and nearly every song mentions booze. 
Modern radios brand safe songs that consistently appeal to the lowest common denominator by being simple enough to get cranked out by a shitty music writing team, or algorithm, I guess, these days, and assigned to dollar sign latest popular artist. I can't stand it. Music should be made by impassioned artists who are in it for love, not be a cash grab. I listen to all sorts of music from mumble rap to black metal, but all genres are affected by this. Modern metalcore, any trap or drill song sung by an rapper with zero experience actually growing up on the street, ditzy pop, modern Nashville factory country. Modern country music. Same, so sterile and formulaic. Tough day, fresh beer, sitting down hunting deer. Four chords and four forwards, now here comes the upbeat chorus. I spend all day and spend all night, wondering if I fixed my truck right, have her another beer yeah, that's what I like to hear. Modern country feels like someone gave chat GPT 3 songs to generate 10,000 songs from. Modern Christian worship music. As someone who partially grew up in a charismatic, Pentecostal-esque church, this music is absolutely grating on the ears. It's repetitive, oddly uninspired in themes and the culty vibes it gives off in praise and worship bands. I don't even hate religious music in general, I like gospel and was born Ukrainian Catholic, meaning I listen to a lot of psalms and hymns from the liturgy and it's oddly beautiful and inspiring, partially due to their mix of minor and diminished scales and modes which makes things way more interesting on top of the ritual of it which is more reserved, yet oddly beautiful in a way. Other people's shitty music I can hear louder than they can, usually on a bus played out to the rest of us through their crappy Apple earphones. Or worse, when they don't even use earphones and just play it out of their phone speaker or a tinny Bluetooth speaker. It's never a good song either. Love pop, same shit over and over again and X200B. Horrible. Deleted. Bad. Bad music I despise. We got two categories. We got that good shit, and we got that other shit. Any music where singers are overly excessive with vocal runs, to the point where they're just showing off that they can do it and it doesn't even suit the melody of the song. Mariah Carey, Ariana Grande and the like. Masturbatory vocalization and it needs to stop. This is the most reddit thread I've seen in a long time. Just like the good old days. The top answer used to be mumble rap. Or I'm a hardcore metalhead but honestly, I love me some Taylor Swift. Regeton. Please, living in Latin America is bad enough already. You don't have to add garbage music about sex with the same drums looping over and over again. Tum tatum ta tum tatum ta tum. When it's just a guy with a spoon. What if it's a guy with a spoon supported by one of the most legendary grunge bands of all time? Regeton. It's not just the fact that it's a repetitive genre with shitty lyrics. But if you're from Latin America like me, you hear it everywhere. Parties, nightclubs, bars, restaurants, on the fucking bus. Bless the headphones. Boom bar doom bap, x128. That's that moombatum drum beat baby. Holland's music. Basically Dutch Schlager. Sad lyrics, happy music. Happy lyrics, sad music. It makes no sense. Modern pop. I know it's a cliche not to like modern music but Shape of You gives me literal headaches. Ed Sheeran doesn't even like Shape of You lol. Modern country. I can't figure out how people distinguish between all of the artists. How many times can you call a song about blue jeans that fit just right, cold beers, county women and pickup trucks that all sound the same original. Also, what's with country singers attempting rap and hip hop? Total crowd pleaser bullshit. Hate it. Country music. Anything from the past 15 years is nothing but dog, beer, 
truck, gun, girl. I guess I'm really describing bro country but when you have a song called I'm Rednecker than you, it kinda puts a bad name on the whole genre. I'm not too fond of the female vocal with slight reverb and a little bit of air at the end of every other word. It started with Mazzy Star which is fine, but too many female vocals use it in today's music making them all sound the same. LOL, the quirky, indie white girl voice. 99% of whatever they play on BBC Radio 1. 